So this man basically did the tsunami version of Hacksaw Ridge. In 2011, Japan was hit by the strongest recorded earthquake in its history at a 9 magnitude, which then triggered a massive tsunami as well, which had waves as high as 133 feet tall. Now at the time, a 43-year-old doctor named Hideaki Akaiwa was working a couple miles away. Since Hideaki's home was in an area that had been completely submerged by 10 foot deep water, he was worried sick. So despite all of the rescue workers telling him that there was nothing he could do, although there were numerous floating houses, cars, and other debris that could have instantly killed him, Hideaki dove into the now submerged streets until he finally made it to his house. Incredibly, he found his wife trapped on the top floor with barely any breathing space left and he was able to rescue her. Then, realizing that his mom was missing as well, he dove right back into the freezing water until he found and rescued her too four days later. If he had waited for the military, both his wife and mom would have died. So realizing just how many other people were still trapped out there, Hideaki went right back into the water again and again, risking his life to save countless random strangers over the next few weeks. 